Hello viewers, welcome to Joy's Kitchen. I hope you are doing well. Today I'm going to show you a very quick and very easy recipe which is I call sausage pumpkin stew. Uh, that one is very nice and very tasty I have to say and very simple to cook. It's some pumpkin, some chicken sausages and some spice and some herbs. So and that's quite healthy as well but because I'm going to cook it in a very small amount of oil. So here you go, check the recipe. And as you can see, I'm, I'm, I'm going to serve it with the couscous and I'm going to show you how I made this couscous as well, uh, which is another easy recipe. So here you go. So to cook my sausage pumpkin uh, stew, I actually took one medium sized pumpkin here, you can see. Uh, it's actually butternut squash or pumpkin, whatever you are using, uh, they are like all same kind of family. So I took one uh, butternut squash here, which is medium sized and I just kind of like uh, peel the skin and then I cubed them, quite chunky pieces, because I need quite chunky pieces for this uh, stew. I took one packet of chicken sausage here. If you want, if you are a vegetarian, you can add a vegetarian sausage. It's totally up to you, but I am a chicken eater, so I took chicken sausage. I took one uh, small size um, onion here and I kind of cubed it and three cloves of garlic and I kind of finely chopped it. So yeah, garlic and onion. Here is two medium sized tomatoes and I kind of cubed it, exactly the same kind of uh, cube pumpkin. I took four green chilies here. These are actually just for smell. It's not going to uh, give any heat in this stew. And I, in the middle, I just kind of like small, uh, make them like a small hole just to release its flavor in the stew. So yeah, four green chili. If you don't have, you can skip it. I took one, around one handful of dill here and I finally chopped it. Dill is kind of like the main ingredient in this uh, stew. Uh, it's going to give it a very nice uh, herby smell and trust me, it's going to be so good. So yeah, of course dill. And for dry spice, I took here actually uh, around one teaspoon of sugar. Sugar going to um, help uh, pumpkin to release its own sweetness. A quarter teaspoon of uh, black pepper powder, quarter teaspoon of cumin powder and one teaspoon of just plain paprika powder. These are the dry spice and salt taste wise. So yeah, these are the dry spice I took. Uh, around one tablespoon of lemon juice here. Lemon juice is going to give it like really nice tangy flavor and uh, olive oil, just plain olive oil. So yeah, these are the like plain simple ingredients I need uh, to cook my pumpkin sausage stew. Because I'm gonna cook this stew in the oven, so I need a proper uh, uh, bowl where I can uh, and I can cover it like properly and it can I steam my whole pumpkin and sausage and all my spices. So yeah, I took one uh, oven proof uh, bowl here, you can see. And now I'm going to mix my all spices and vegetables and sausages all together. This is quite quick, easy dish as I said. This is all about mixing. So I put my onions and chopped garlics here. Now I'm going to mix in my uh, dill, chopped dill. Dill gonna give it a very nice smell, a flavor, trust me. This is like, because dill have quite strong smell in the all herbs. Now I'm adding my uh, green chilies here. Now I'm adding my chopped or cubed tomatoes. My dry spices. This all the spice and herbs and chilies and garlics and tomatoes and pumpkins, they're all gonna complement each other. They are really like good together, trust me. Now around one tablespoon of olive oil, I don't need too much oil for this too. This is quite healthy and very light dish actually. And if you add vegetarian sausage, you can call it actually vegetarian stew as well. So now I'm going to mix these things together first, just to release and uh, complement to each other. Oh, I can smell already. Very nice. And trust me, this chili is not going to release any heat in this stew. They, they are just here to uh, flavor my curries. If you don't have, you can skip this chili uh, part actually but uh, I quite like the green chili flavor in my pumpkin stew. 
Now, at first, I'm gonna add my sausages, but I'm gonna, not gonna cook my sausages now because sausage cook very easily and it take uh, uh, actually less time than pumpkin. So what I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna marinate my sausage with these spices and then I'm gonna put it somewhere else, separate. So I'm trying to cover my sausages with the spices and uh, dill and uh, tomatoes all together. And now I'm going to put it in a separate bowl or in the same bowl. I'm not going to cook it now because they, they take really uh, less time and pumpkin going to take at least one hour to become soft. And I don't want to overcook my sausages so yeah my sausages are done. Now I'm going to add my pumpkins and I'm going to again uh, going to mix it together exactly the way I done with the sausages. And this chunky piece of uh, pumpkin because I don't want to uh, cook them too much or make them like a mushy baby food that's why I keep them quite chunky pieces so yeah I'm gonna mix them together properly So as you can see my pumpkins are covered properly with all the spices and herbs and now I'm going to add those lemon uh, juice in it and I'm going to mix them again together. Lemon juice is just going to give it like a little bit of tanginess. Before I put it, my pumpkin in the oven, I'm going to add around a half cup of boiling water. This water is going to help the pumpkin to release its own water or own juice. Otherwise, it's going to burn inside my uh, steaming pot. So yeah, half cup of water should be fine uh, for that amount of uh, pumpkin. And then I'm going to cover it and I'm going to put it in the oven. So I'm going to put it in the oven for uh, one and a half hour and uh, the temperature gonna be 180 degree it depends which kind of oven you are using but I'm, I'm uh, my in my oven I'm gonna put it in 180 degree and it's gonna take not more than one and a f one hour 30 minutes so this is the couscous I made uh, I actually took one cup of couscous here and I added two cup of boiling water in it and half chicken cube uh, chicken stock cube and a little bit of salt like one teaspoon of salt and then I leave it for 10 minutes and that's how it looks it looks very good and then I added some chopped bell pepper which I use like green and red bell pepper you can see it, they make it like really pretty and that's it so here you go guys, this is my sausage pumpkin stew is ready and as you can see I added some uh, fresh dill on top of it and trust me, you see the recipe, how easy it is and it's really healthy and really good for your body and uh, try to eat it with this kind of couscous which I made and I showed you, uh, they, they goes really good together and uh, you can eat like you're not gonna feel guilty at all. And and don't forget to like and subscribe my channel and follow my recipes and share my recipes with your friends, family and neighbors. And trust me, you should cook it and you should try it and you should eat it. So here you go. Bye bye. Ta-da.